All right, we're back with another replay cast here on this 24-hour stream in the bottom left-hand side of Golden Wall in the red. It is the Protoss player Rage. And in the bottom right-hand side in the blue, it is the Protoss player Laotian. All right. This was sent to me by, I think, uh, whole, what was his name again? Da uh, uh, I can't remember. God damn it. Diophage? Di Diophage? It's, it's the last name I remember in my mind. I, I remember vaguely the shape of it, okay? Oh, God. Whew. We can do this. Honestly, in um, it's crazy. In one hour, we'll be halfway through. Isn't that crazy? Shit. Okay, what the fuck is happening right now? Uh, we've got a gateway here at the front. Uh, so it's going to be Wallen. And I'm not sure what this prob is doing. Going for... Okay, proxy pylon. Okay, okay. That's step number one. These players are not... This does not look like the standard coot gate. Oh my god. Not going for Nexus. This feels like a... It's just a gateway expand. Both of them just do gateway expands. What is this? At the same time, to be honest, on Golden Wall, I think it's very passable. It's probably the best map to do said... Uh, said gateway expand. Is there another map where you could do gateway expand? I think as, as soon as you have a ramp here, it's pretty possible. The problem is that you'll, you're still going to have that ad adept problem, basically. And what is this? That's another gateway. Hello. All right, Laotian, you're gonna be... Okay, so he's Cybercore's final death. So I think Laotian is gonna get some tech out first. But there's a... He's doing a proxy gateway while expanding as well. Does he have a Cybercore? He, in fact, does not have a Cybercore. He's just stealing gases now. Okay. Uh, I don't know what to make of this. Twilight Council here. On the way, could go into Dark Shrine, can go into Blink as well. Could be a pretty good choice. Uh, but anyway. So far, pretty standard build out of Laotian. The other Protoss, though, Rage, is going for Proxy Gate Zealot with double gas steal and no Cybercore. Now, the Cybercore is coming up now. It's not too late. Can you kill the pylon, though? There is some value in this pylon. For sure. There's 100 minerals exactly, actually. Oh, can you, mi can you micro the adept, though? <gasps> okay, there you go. There you go. Okay. Very good. Okay, so more zealots coming across the map. Are they going to see the adepts, though? Uh, sorry, the zealots? <gasps> Are they going to finish the shade? Oh, they will. Now, the Zelts are just going to literally walk in and start killing some pros and stuff. <gasps> what is he doing, mate? Oh, no. Look at that. Now, they have to walk all the way back. Oh, no. This is not good. This is not good. Good lord. Team Logical. Gifting subs to... He gifted an anonymous sub to El Canadiano, of all people. El Canadiano. Alright, so the Proxy Zealot is starting to not work anymore. The, uh, the Adepts that were halfway across the map turned around. And now he's going to deal with this double stolen gas. As the opponent goes into a Dark Shrine, full memes ahead. This truly is the peak of NA. Blink on the way as well for Leotion. Now, I thought Leotion was going to go Dark Shrine himself, but no. Luckily, though, he is getting uh, the Robo facility to get an Observer. But I think that might be a little bit late because the Dark Shrine is over halfway done. All right, see you, Evolve Reaver. Thank you very much for passing by. Been a great chat. Great chatter, my guy. And Team Logical. Okay, Xanatos, thank you very much. For stopping by. Now there's a proxy nexus at the goal base. Not 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 like his own side of the map, you know, like his the other side of the map. Yeah, 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 of course. This is this is excellent. 
Oh, but however, oh, look at that. He does see the Dark Shrine, though, and that's kind of the, that's the problem here, is that now with the Dark Shrine being, Triple Forge. What the? Oh, come on, dude. This is getting, this is so stupid. This is so stupid. He's getting an Observer, though, right? So I think he's not going to get caught by this, although he is sending, I think, the Observer across the map? Question mark? Wait, hold on. He has no idea, right? <gasps> but the Observer might see it. Uh Oh. Sh oh my god, my game just froze. Okay. Oh. No. Seriously? Oh. Oh, he sees it now though. He sees it now though. And the DTs are here though. That's the problem. Yikes. Oh. Swipe, 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 swipe. Oh my god. Okay, there you go. What is happening right now? Okay, so DT's now he's going to proxy a robo while going triple forge and our proxy nexus at the goal base. These Bronze League heroes, this is worse, my guy. I think this is somewhere. This is diamond smurfing or something of the sort. <laughs> Okay, well, the Nexus is unfortunately not going to survive. <gasps> will he get our second probe? No, he will not. One probe is all he will get. I think it might live, though. He does see it. Oh, he doesn't see it, but Laotian sees it. It's a standoff. Is he going to kill the probe? <gasps> the probe is trying to hide right now. It's hiding. <gasps> it hit successfully. It, he did it. He did it. He didn't see him. Jesus. Very nice. Now is a proxy robo. Supply block proxy robo. And DT Blink is on the way with charge as well. Alright. A lot of stalkers coming across the map though. So this might be a little bit difficult to hold. Um, yep. Although there, there is no observer. I think if you just warp in one DT he wins. Also Blink is here. That's pretty damn good. Oh, the DTs are coming back home though. Oh, he's going to target fire the... Okay, so he's not going to get DT Blink, turns out. He's going to get a DT4 defense. I don't know if it's going to be enough, though. Oh, he's losing a lot of pros right now, though. Oh, no, we don't have to blink outside, dude. Now he just got cut. Oh, man. DTs are actually going to do a fair bit of damage here. Okay, still survived that so far. What the hell, dude? What is he, wait, what is he recalling? <gasps> he recalled the Immortal. Okay, so he's recalling the Immortal for the defense. Let's go. Okay, so he's going to survive this one. What's in behind here? Um, I guess Laotian is just going to keep macroing? I don't know, dude. Oh man, this probe. He was hiding, he came out, and then he's going back to hide. Ah, uh, Zealots. He does have a shield battery though, and he can always overcharge it, so I don't think Rage can bust him here. I don't think. Oh, he does have two immortals. Oh, proper force fields though. But uh, even if he does force field, honestly, I think it's almost better to guardian shield because. You can just blink away from the force fields. You can just blink behind the force fields. All right. Okay. More zealots. Here we go. Almost basically an equal worker count. And is Rage going to be going for a third base? I think so. He's prepping for it, though. He's gonna grab it though. Oh no no no! You can't step outside your base. I mean, just stay here with the battery. I think that's definitely the best move. Okay, very good. Okay, both. Uh, this is a little bit of a Mexican standoff where it's like you, you can't walk out, but I you, the other one can't walk in either. 
he is picking off a lot of zealots. He's shaving them off quite a bit. I think once you realize there's this many stalkers, you should probably just run home. Because at this point, all he has to do is kite. In fact, I don't think it's enough. I don't think it's enough. Oh no, Rage is not doing good. Oh, the reinforcements though of Zealots can do a lot of work. Look at that. Yeah, dude, Zealots are so stupidly strong. So he holds that, and but it's still three Immortals and Stalkers. The problem is that like if he doesn't kite properly, then the Zealots will always actually just always win. Um, if you look at the minerals though, both don't even have the money to expand. This is pretty all in. All over the place. Okay. He's going to be going for the gold base. I do agree with this, especially considering the fact that there's a proxy up there. Does he even know about it? No, he has no idea, dude. He has no idea. He's going to walk up here. He's like, why is there a robo in two gates? Did I miss something? Oh, can he snipe the observers, though? And not with sentries, I don't think. Oh, man. Oh, man. This is close. Oh, but the reinforcements of Zealots and Zealots are so strong, man. Surrender, please. And he just leaves the game. Oh, my God. What did I just watch? I mean, he just kept going on Stalkers a lot. Actually, honestly, I'd almost just rather make mass Adepts um, against Charge Lots. You just kite with Adepts, and you'd make do so much damage to the every single... Um, it's every single zealot there. He is very kind.